you first of all, Andy. You scored in the win over Burnley yeah. at the weekend. First of all, was it good to get on the, the score sheet? And second of all, to get a win? Yeah, finally we got a win, so that was that was good after we've had quite a few ups and downs throughout the season so far. So it was also good to score as well. I haven't scored many. So, <laughs> was that your first goal for the side? Second this season, like, but as a centre back, you don't score as many as the forwards, so it was always good to score. Goal. And you just mentioned about the win. It's nice to, to sort of get that win. It's been a, bit a difficult start for the lads, but do you feel as though you, you're beginning to hit your stride now? Yeah, I do feel as if um, the first years have settled in now. I'm starting to bond quite nicely as a team. And the performance on the pitch is showing now as well, and in training. So, How difficult is it for the first years coming in to a new environment at a football club and sort of going through that gelling process? Well, a, f- a few of the first years were, were ca- kind of getting a bit of experience on the bench for the youth team last year, so kind of, some of us were kind of used to it, although we weren't in, involved in the games as much. But most of the first years are like new lads, so it was hard for them to come in and settle in and getting in with the new playing style, and playing with new players. So finally, we've started settling down and we can get a few wins in a few games. In terms of yourself, you've been involved with the first team in the behind closed doors games a lot this season. How good has that been for you in your development? Oh, it's been it's been excellent. It's like learning off the pros and the the way they play and passing in stuff down to me and encouraging me. It's been really good for my development. And I'm, I'm starting to take some of the stuff into bringing it back down with me when I come and play with the team as well.